This should be fine. Okay, ready, ready. Oh, we didn't get it. Oh, we got it. We got it. Nailed it. Okay. And then Skittle. This all work out just fine. What can happen? Welcome back to a brand new video, TBF Gaming, jumping back into ARK's Final Evolved, the Pyrea playthrough. Excited to get going today. This playthrough has been a lot of fun. The models in this playthrough are some of the best we've ever played. Obviously, this is more of a vanilla kind of straight up style. I think our next playthrough, we might move back into either, either Primal Fear or Supreme or one of the big bad dino mods that it is a little bit crazy in terms of damage and everything going on. Or maybe even go back to an Eternal, like a straight Eternal playthrough. I don't know. We're going to do something in the next playthrough that's going to be the complete opposite of this, where it's going to be just a, a all-over-the-place crazy adventure. But this one has been a lot of fun, and mainly because of the models in this one. Shad's stuff, the stuff that Shadlos works on, is absolutely incredible. All these models, all these different variations, just so much cool stuff in this mod. Every day we're finding a new dino that I'm just completely enamored by. So it's been a lot of fun. Now today, we were doing a little bit of stuff. We were doing a little bit of breeding. There is a dino out here that was trolling us just a little bit. It is, there he is. I don't know if you can see him really well out there. It's kind of a mix between a Spino and a Deinonychus, I think. It's a Dino Charius. And I think that's that's either an Aberrant or an X version, but I can't remember which one. But that guy definitely was trying to wreck my face. He definitely swings like a Spino, but he kind of runs around like a Deinonychus. And he's got little feather arms. I don't know, he's very cool looking though. But we want to tame it, but unfortunately, it says passive, so that's the first thing. It says passive and it says that you need Swamp Boss. Hold on, who's the lower level? All right, we're gonna go do some testing. Hopefully we don't die. Let's go test this out. I'm hoping that this guy is what causes him not to attack me. But it says he's a passive tame and that he needs Swamp Boss Kibble. Let's see if this, is he gonna attack us? Okay, no. Oh, we might be okay. Or is it just a sneak up on him thing? Oh, it's so scary. Maybe he has like an Equus where you just have to stay behind him. I'm just trying to see if we get close enough to where it says feed kibble. Must be level 92. Oh, okay, okay. All right, so there you go. I don't know if it was the fact that we had this guy on my shoulder or that we stayed behind him, but he at least didn't attack us, but I got to get to level 92. We are currently 86. Wow. I really thought I was a higher level. This has been a very slow playthrough in terms of leveling. But that's kind of, kind of how it was designed. We wanted this to be kind of a vanilla-based playthrough. But I hope you guys are having a great day. I think today is Thursday? Question mark? So it should be Thursday's video. We should have a video today and tomorrow. Saturday and Sunday will be back to the mod spotlights. And we're actually doing a map spotlight on either Saturday or Sunday. And then the other one, I'm not sure which one it was. I didn't write it down. But yeah, we got a whole. Oh, okay, let's, let's get focused here. So today... Something that we haven't worked on really much this season that I really want to get into is the some of the stations within the Pyrea mods. So I want to check out the Alchemy Station and the Necromancy Table. There's some really cool stuff in here. One thing that we want to make that we can't quite make yet is there is a summoning circle where the fun really takes place. Make sure it's powered by dark mana. Now, we're getting close to it. I can make the Mithril Ingot with our buddy over here. He can make that for us. But the... We got to go black pearl collecting. So we need to go black pearl collecting. So I need to go ahead and get some scuba and then go underwater and get that done. So we're going to work on that. The other thing that we were wanting to take a look at. Scared the junk out of me. The other thing that we're looking at is inside of here. There's a couple things. The summons, the demonology. You can make a hellhound. A loyal spectral hound. I really want to check this out. Same thing. For this one, I need black pearls and we have everything else. The mana... We're getting from these guys over here. We're getting the mana from, uh, I think, you guys are giving me the light mana, right? Yeah, they're producing light mana for days. It looks like 700 might be the max on these guys. We probably take a second to transfer this all out. Let's do that. I think we can go like this. Hold on. I, I never use this. We don't use it very often. Advanced transfer, right? Hopefully I'm doing this right. Our friend Crazy Hermit reminds us of this all the time. All right, advance. There you go. We'll go. No. Yeah, there you go. So we'll go all dinos, and then mana, dark mana, light mana, and then destination is the OCD transfer. There you go. 4,100 items transferred. Nice. So now they should be empty, right? Did it work? Oh, my God, it worked. Also, you guys need food really, really bad. Some of you guys haven't eaten at all. My bad. I will get a feeding trough down and worry about that in just a second. Okay, so that's that, kind of the little side stuff. 
So let's work on black pearls for that. We definitely need to go ahead and get some scuba stuff. So I guess we're going water adventuring today. I will check out the breeding stuff that we're doing up top. We're doing some dire wolf and tiger breeding up there. Uh, but if we didn't already say it, like, comment, subscribe on this video. We're working our way towards 17,000 subs. We might get it over this next weekend or so. I'm hoping that we're going to hit that 17,000 mark. And then the big goal for the year is 20,000. And obviously, we're going to try and get over that. We're going to work our butt off. And I'm going to start. I should be back to two videos a day every day for the next month or two. We got a, a bunch of time off at work. So I'm going to be working my butt off here on YouTube. So hopefully we can see some good results from that. So thank you so much for joining me on this adventure. It's been a lot of fun. Huge shout out to the patrons. They make everything possible. We'll be starting a new patron server in the next week or two. And that, that should be a lot of fun. I'm not even sure which one the next one is. And then of course we're going to have the return, eternal rewipe too. Oh man, why do I have Raptors in here? Why is, it, why is there Raptors in my Smithicator? Okay, focus. What were we working on? We need scuba. Oh, we need the Smithicator top, don't we? We need the Smithicator top. I also need to get some more electronics, so we should probably work on that today. Uh, let's see. Where is my AA bench? Here we go. Let's go ahead and get our Smithicator top. Please see I can do it. Oh, no. Oil. Oh, but we can do oil. Also, you know what? We actually have a random dino out in the wild. we got to go rescue real quick. So let's go get some oil, and let's grab this rescue over here. But that, that'll be the plan today. So I'm going to do... A little bit of underwater stuff. We might try to tame something underwater. I don't really try to tame many things underwater. What is this? Oh, he's cool. An Edmontosaurus. Do I love all these different crazy dinos. The amount of distraction I have. This is really hard for someone like me that just can't stay focused. But I think right over here we can find oil underwater. So we'll jump down under there and get oil. And then, oh, look at this. How cool is this? I fly, I fly by this all the time. This is one of my favorite little spots. We have it on the server where the foundations aren't required to touch the ground, so people can build sky bases. It just makes it nice for server health where you can have people build like all over like the corners of the map so they're not right in the middle of the map with this giant extravagant base. If I ever do a breeding center, I usually do it like on, out on the side. All right, somewhere here. Whoa, what is going on there? Well, that's someone's base. All right, there should be. Oh, no. Uh-oh. Uh-oh. Uh -oh. You guys, this stuff's going to die. Okay, we're looking for... Somewhere out here, we had a Gil Regarian taming up an orc. Wait, it's not still going to show up on the thing, is it? Nope, okay. You had to try. It was from last night, so I didn't think it was still here. Gil Regarian. Oh, they expanded. Look at that. <laughs> That's cool. Zombies. There we go. Did you guys tame up? Yeah, you did. Good job, buddy. Oh, what is over there? What is that guy? Hey, oh, it's a different type of flyer. <gasps> I want it. Okay, focus. So we got this guy now. Oh, we can ride these guys too. Nice. Oh, good stuff. Do you gather? I don't know. Let's gather something. Oh, maybe not. Oh, that was crazy. Okay, I definitely want to try this on something, but here, let's go punch a dodo. Here you go. Super punch. Or oh, does it take a while to recharge maybe? Let's try it again. No? Left click? Right click. C button? Oh. Oh. Oh, what was that? Oh, this dude's cool, man. I've never tried this one out. All right, you get picked up. Uh, you got hide on. You don't need it. There's our buddy. We're going to use you to go pick up some stuff. Grab that, and let's see if there's oil over here. I don't remember if there's oil here. I might have to look for it for a second before we can find it. So I'll go looking for oil, and then I'll meet you guys back at the... Oh, no, we, we don't have to look for it. Look at that. Look how lucky we're getting today. It's meant to be. And I know there's a couple oil pumps around the map somewhere. We could have probably teleported to that, but it's okay. Here we go. Get some oil action. Uh, this is probably not the best guy to gather it, but it's not too bad. Was that the only one? No, there's some way over there. Nice. This is not the best water guy. I probably should have brought the Ostroraptor. But yeah, let me go. I'm going to gather this last bit of oil. I'll meet you guys back at base in just a minute. All right, back over at the base place. Hopefully the Dino Cherries is not going to attack us real quick. Let's get inside and make our scuba stuff. We'll get our Smithicator top and then the scuba stuff. Please don't attack. Please don't attack. I think we're good. All right. We had to jump on the Tiger because we actually had a lot of weight on us. The amount of inventory stuff was kind of insane. The looked like they had gathered a whole bunch of stuff out there. We've got large aged bone, large aged skull, some mana stuff, a dark soul. Lots of crazy stuff in here. Whatever this is, the small aged bone. I don't know, it's a lot of junk. 
A lot of crazy stuff, right? Let's go basic transfer, like so. Throw this all in here, or what we can at least. Uh, full? Full. Okay. Let's go ahead and make our smithicator top. Let's go smithication. Boom. Bam. Got it. All right. Smithicator top. Check. And we made the generator yesterday. I don't know if it actually has power right now. Let's throw that on there. Do we have a little bit of gas? We got a little bit of gas. We'll go like this. Hold on. We could have just transferred it from there, but we'll go gas. Drop. And we're using AA2, so because of that, we have to do this little broken method uh, because it's not updated. AA2 is not going to get updated anymore. So a couple of things that don't work in there. There you go. Boom. A couple of things that don't work in there are uh, kind of a pain. But AA2 still works really good, and it's just one mod. So one core mod just makes it a little bit easier to load. All right, cool. We got power. Let's get on the Smithicator now. I'll turn you on. Let's work on Scuba. I don't know if we're going to have the stuff for this. We might have to go getting some silica pearls maybe oh maybe we'll have it but i just need to go down and get some of the black pearls because if i remember right there's black pearls in the underwater ocean i hope that's correct if not we'll go around and try to find the things that we got to kill for it or maybe the tuso or something all right do i got skittle on me if we got skittle we'll just roll with it uh there skittle come on buddy all right now we got to be careful because skittle does get attacked by all the fish monsters i think the entrance is right over there in fact let's go on the pteranodon first go Pteranodon. Let's go Holyfield. I'm going to take you out. Oh, and we didn't check out the breeding stuff. I want to show you that before we roll out. Up here, we've got our tigers. The tigers are looking amazing. we got now two with the red mane, and we got one orange one. I'm hoping to get a really better orange one. I'm hoping... We had a white tiger before, like an all-white. I'm hoping we get one like that again, because they look absolutely epic. And then the wolves, I haven't got any cool colors yet, but the levels are starting to get pretty good. There's some pretty high melee stats in there. All right, let's head out. So I think, if I remember right, it's right over here. I've played Valgaro somewhere around a thousand times, but I don't go underwater very often. So I might not know where this one is. Let's go look for this spot. If I remember right, you just have to look for like the little, it's like a stone outcrop. I'm trying to get a little higher. Here we go, right here. Yeah. It's been a while. Man, it looks so weird flying on this bird like he's not even there. It's like right here-ish, right? Yeah, definitely right here-ish. <laughs> All right. Uh, okay. We don't know what's going to be down there, but this should be fine. Okay. Ready? Ready? Oh, we didn't get it. Oh, we got it. We got it. Nailed it. Okay. And then Skittle. This all work out just fine. What could happen? There you go. Get on him quickly. I don't know what's behind me. Just go, 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 go. Nailed it. All right. Now, let's go ahead and switch to the scuba. There you go. Suit up. I, I cannot stand that outline, but oh well. All right, let's go here. Where's the entrance? Yeah, I don't remember exactly. I just know it's in this general area. We'll find it. Is this it? Here we go. And I don't know what's going to be down here. I don't remember if there's crazy stuff down here or not. I think two souls used to be down here back in the day or Mosas or like an Alpha Mosa, but since it's modded, you might see some crazy stuff. I know there's an arcane Tuso and an arcane, a couple of the arcane fish. I can't think what they're called. A basil, basilosaurus, whatever they're called. And now we just have to go, I think, that way. I think we got to take a couple lefts. But it should be good. Oh, you know what, though? I just realized that our guy is on our shoulder. I hope our little guy doesn't drown. We didn't really think this through. All right, I think we're going the right way. It's pretty quiet down here. Uh, let's turn on... Oh, there's stuff down there. I'm going to turn on the outline just so we can see. Oh, wow. There's a freaking Ostroraptor down here. I mean, they're basically aquatic uh, animals, so I get it. But, dang, that's crazy. You don't ever want to go up for air? All right. I hope we're going the right way. I feel like we're going the wrong way. Maybe not. But if I, if I have to, we'll, we'll go searching for a minute, and I'll bring you back once we find it. I know it's just out here somewhere. Yeah, we might have definitely went the wrong way. All right, maybe I'll just keep kind of. I'll just keep following the wall. Hopefully, we'll be able to find it. And then if I can't find it, I'll go look up the grid for it. I know it's out here somewhere. So yeah, let me let me look for it. So we're not just sitting here babbling the whole time. And I'll hopefully see you when we find black pearls or if we get attacked. All right, I took forever finding these guys. I swam right over them like 25 times, and I went over and found a video from one of our favorite YouTubers, Teachers Game 2. Absolutely awesome channel. They always have good tutorials. 
came over here, and boom, there we are. So there you go. We need a bunch now. Hopefully there's more than just this little crop, but this is the only one I found so far. But he said basically all over this area here. So it took forever to find, but 40 to 25-ish. Uh, and I, I Googled it, and Google told me a little bit off from here, but it wasn't too far off. Oh, my God, I did. I swam right over these. I didn't see the little black. Like, I, I expected them to be shinier, I think. So let's grab as many as we can. Yeah, there you go, man. Awesome. Give me all the black pearls. There you go. Perfect. Because we we need it for a few different recipes. So if we can get all of it, we'll be good to go. Black pearls. All right. I can't believe we swam right over these so much. Oh, my goodness. There's more. They're everywhere. We literally went right past them. But it's been pretty quiet down here. I don't know if we need to maybe do a dino wipe because there's not really that much down here. And maybe it just doesn't spawn that much down here at all. But I know some, some mods, you'll see quite a bit of things down here. There you go. There's another hundred there. How many we got? That is a thousand. That should last us like five minutes. So let's do this. We can go ahead and go back. Let me just see if there's one more little crop of it. I think we're good for right now. We can definitely come back over here and look for more later. But let's do this. We're going to teleport out. That'll give us a teleport spot to here. I'll bring a teleporter down here eventually. And let's go. Where is... Where's the actual green obelisk? There we go. It's kind of a dangerous area, but it'll give us a chance to fly through here real quick and see if there's anything cool to tame up. Always got to add something each episode to, you know, to the collection. Uh, we got down here. We got a... Oh, there we go. See? What are you? You are a... You are crazy looking. All right, let's get rid of this outline. Can't stand that. Okay, are you a passive? It says you're a passive. Are you going to eat me? Oh, we got to take this stuff off. Let's get rid of that awful, awful scuba look. Okay. Are you going to attack me when I jump off? That's the real question. This guy wants... We could do kibble, and it'd just be a one-shot. Boom. Okay. Let's see if it attacks. So far, no. Yeah, there you go. A Valor. Oh, get off there. What's up, little dude? Come here. Oh, you need a saddle. Okay. Look at this guy. Part chicken, part raptor. That's even that's even more of a raw chicken than the uh, Deinonychus is. Very cool. Oh, there's a nice little spot. Oh, it's Hermit, of course. If you guys have been around the channel for a while, you know Hermit is always in a cave. Because <laughs> that's, that's the name. It's got to be. Uh, let's see. I don't know where we're at. Okay, we got to go east. I definitely went the wrong way. That's fine. We'll circle up here. Let's see if there's anything cool to add to the team up here. We got one dino at least. That's kind of the rule. We have to add at least one dino. I'm good with the progression episode, but we absolutely have to have one or two new tames every episode. Unless we're playing like a super modded where we're, you know, we're focusing on like one tame or two tames in an episode. Oh, wow. What is that thing? Oh, is that that? That's the Diorex. 75,000. Hmm. Let's go see how strong he is. I've got some tigers that we got to get rid of anyway. There we go. We're going to throw these guys out. These are all throwaways. These are the leftovers after the breeding process. So these guys all have, like, either bad stats or, you know, just one of their stats is really low. Unless there's an all-white tiger. We'll save them. Uh, anybody else? Uh, there's another Atlas tiger, but that one's got the saddle, so we'll hold on to that one. All right. Okay, you guys coming? Let's go. Come on. Everybody coming? There you go. All right. I need you guys to attack. Go ahead. Get in there, buddy. Oh, well, that's not working out well. That rock. The rock is thwarting him. Hold on. Go there. Go there. Then attack. There you go. Get him. How are you guys doing? You're doing okay. Uh, probably going to be some deaths. Oh, they're doing that bleeding damage, though. Look at that. Oh, they're eating hellhounds, too. Nice. Do your thing, guys. Oh, the tigers are amazing. I want to help, but I also don't want to die. Ooh, crazy. Do we got anybody else that can jump in just to help for a minute? Uh, Das Plate, Elephantosaurus, the Dagon, Spurgersburg, um... You got five thousand. You got six thousand health. You can help a little bit. Get in there, Dagon. You have a saddle on. You got a little bit of armor. There you go. Get him. There you go. Oh, things are dying now. It's all going downhill now. 
Hold on, who else do we have? Atlas Tiger, get it there. What else we got? Get in there, guys. Get in there, guys. Get in there. You guys can do this. I believe in you. I believe. All right. Uh, where's our big guy? Hold on. Do we still have... There's that one. No, no. All right. We're going in with the big guns. Okay, please don't die. All right, we're going in. Now that you guys have done all the hard work. There you go. Get him. Get in there, Tamer. Oh, my God. I picked up all the stuff. All right, we're a little electrocuted. <gasps> no, no, no. Let me back on. Let me back on. Let me back on. No. Okay. No deaths. Kill the Diorex. Take out the dragon. Come on, almost dead. Yeah! Self Inferno Potion, Upgraded Pyrean Rock Drake Saddle, and a Self Blizzard Potion. Yeah, take that. Good job, whoever's left. <laughs> that was awesome. That was absolutely awesome. Let's go ahead and pick everybody up. I know, man. I'm excited, too. The amount of sounds that these guys make. All right. So there's that. Not that I'm going to be able to see what else is down here. Can we not gather you? Do you have anything in your inventory? Oh, you do. Artifact of the Brute. 1,800 mana and 34 soothing areas. Okay, okay. Let's get whoever's left. Let's bring you out. Who's still alive? Anybody? Did no one else survive? Did all the tigers die? I don't know if there's any other tigers hiding under here. That was an awesome fight, man. That was cool. All right, that's one way to get rid of the tigers. All right, let's see. So we got some crazy stuff on the inventory when I picked everything up there. We got 160 of the Dark Mana Reaper scales. We've got the Dark Mana Reaper tail spike and the Dark and the Dark Mana Reaper head, which we need for some crafting stuff. Very cool. Uh, we got a bunch of black pearls from what we already got. We got a little bit from that too. Bunch of other crazy stuff. Skull. Uh, scrap metal, obviously. Red gem. Man, a bunch of this cadaver stuff. Not so much sure what that's used for. But all right, I'm, I'm hoping I didn't leave anybody. Here, let me see if there's like someone hiding underneath there. I don't think so. Okay, I think we're good. Watch there be like one tiger hiding under there like, don't leave me. All right. Okay, let me get back to base. That was actually a fun little detour. If there's something else to tame, I will definitely tame it. Otherwise, we're just heading to base. Oh, no. What did we just jump into? Slow down. Oh, slow down there, dude. Uh, there's a Tyranno Titan in there. That's awesome. Uh, oh, it's a bunch of the little guys. All right. Just coming through. Don't mind me. <laughs> awesome. I definitely want another Tyranno Titan to breed with the one that we have, but for right now, we'll just kind of skip by it. Yeah, I didn't, I, I didn't really mean to bring you guys back already, but since we already did, we're right around the corner from base anyways. So now we're going to get back to base. We're going to go ahead and make up... Oh, oh, what do we got? There's a glowy guy. An Alpha Herrerasaurus. There is some craziness happening over here. Man, um, we could definitely take it, and I definitely need to, but I'm, I'm more worried about, yeah, let's let's not right now, just because we got to focus on our, our task at hand, but I do need to start taking out as many alphas as possible. Also, please stop taking fall damage. I think these guys should have no fall damage with the way that they jump and everything, but I guess since they're already aquatic animals, and they're already... You know, not visible to most other dinos. I guess they don't need any more OP stuff. Carno Raptor. Oh. Divine Allos. These guys are passive tame with special kibble. Alright, are they going to attack? Okay. Come here, come here. Just trying to be friends. <gasps> it worked. Pick him up. Okay. These are super low level. We'll need way better ones later, but these are pretty cool looking. And I think they have some special powers. Hey, can you come down? I can't quite reach you. There you go. <laughs> Couple of super easy tames. They're very low level, but we'll try those guys out as soon as we get back to base. There you go. I tell you that I'm not going to tame anything, that we're going to get focused, and then 10 minutes later we're still taming things. Ooh, what's this? Uh, Papa K's place. Check out this little spot. 
Did I load the vape? Oh, there's a windmill. How cool is that? <gasps> Ooh, look at that holographic guy. Oh, man, this is this is why we love this game so much. All right, uh, let's see. We should be right around the corner from base. Not take too much fall damage. What do we got here? More divine aloes? Oh, it's meant to be, see? We got three of them here. Come be my friend. There you go. There you go. These are all low levels, but we'll get a better level one eventually. Ooh, what's that? A aura seeker. I want an aura seeker. There's some aura kibble that we can make up, but it says that it takes raw mutton. Should we try the mutton just to see? All right. If he lands, we feed him. But I'm only going to give him like a minute. Like not even that. Like a few seconds. Because we're, we're, we're focused. Not very well, but we're focused. All right. We're out. Plus, it's not even a great level. we got to wait until we start seeing some better levels anyway. All right, let's go this way. So if nothing else, there you go. we got Divine Allos. I will definitely go look for some better ones once we finish our little main missions today. But let's get over here, see if we can make up this Hellhound thing. Wait for the base to load in. Back home. All right, very cool. All right, your inventory is going to be an absolute nightmare. Let's just transfer most of it. So we're going to go transfer. And then I'll get working on my automated arc stuff. I'll get everything automated and put into better storage just for right now. We're just kind of all over the place. Uh, boom. There you go. All right. You're good to go. Now let's go look at this hellhound thing. See how it works. So inside of here, we've got summons, demonology. We actually might be able to make... Are we close to the other one? We're missing three... We need 300 black pearl for that, which we have. What else? Uh, we need 300 black pearl dust. How do I get black pearl dust? Dust? Do you make dust? Who makes dust? No. Hmm. Somebody's got to make dust. Not there. Where do I get dust? Hmm. All right. Maybe it's a... Is it a recipe? Dust. Black pearl dust can only be crafted at dot. <laughs> Oh, here we go. Oh, only a Balrog is capable of generating enough heat to burn down black pearls into dust. Strangely enough, in the state, black pearls... Oh, cool, man. So we need Balrog. Gotcha. I have no idea how to get that either. All right, back to summons. Back to demonology. We should have everything for the Hellhound. Boom. It's going to take a while. And then the other one, we need black pearl dust as well. What about this other one? Elementals. Oh, gosh. Fire elemental crystal times 5,000. I've had a couple. We can, we can make the crystals. But hold on. How much is it? It's sulfur times 4,600. Wow. An elemental core times one. And so let me see. Is it this one that we make element on? Yeah, we make element here. We can make. Wow. So I can make those fire element with stone and mana. Okay. So if I craft it up that, how many does it make per? Because we need a crazy amount. 30 per? That's not bad. Okay. That might be doable. It's just going to take a while. All right. Let's grab this hellhound thing. My poor inventory is looking like a nightmare. I'm so sorry. Let's go check this out. All right. And I assume it's a consume. Consume. Oh, he's right in front of me. Hold on. Get out. Wow. Okay. It's already writable. Oh, look at this bad boy. Oh, man. Demon puppy. This this reminds me of the uh, the guys off of uh, Supernatural. You guys ever saw Supernatural? Even though they're invisible most of the time. Oh, they don't do very much damage. Okay. <laughs> I expected more. Still very cool. Right, what level are we? I didn't even check my level. Alright, what level are you? Uh, oh, it's a good level, though. It's a really good level. 225, 22 melee, 31 health. I don't know. Maybe we should get a do a couple more and see if we can breed them. I wonder if they're breedable. Are you breedable? I don't know. You're definitely cool looking. A little scary. <laughs> you can definitely use, you know, maybe grow your hair out. All right, let's go drop you off. Let me look in there again and see... The fire crystal that we made up, how close does that get up? I know we're not going to be anywhere close, but summons, elemental. So just from that little bit, oh, that's not the right one. 
Oh, we made Earth Element. Oh, I didn't read it. Ah, uh, my bad. Hold on. Ella. I made Earth. We need to make fire. Dang it, dude. So I need sulfur for days. So we need to get a sul... Oh, you know what? I have those sulfur worms. Are they not producing? Let me see. I've got at least one or two of the sulfur worms. Oh, uh, well, where are they? Uh, oh, no. Hmm. Well, maybe I don't. I had a sulfur worm. Maybe I left it back on Aberration. I must have. Dang it. Okay. We can go back to Aberration again, but I've got sulfur worms. I'm wondering if they actually produce the stuff. All right, you guys back to producing stuff as well? Yes. Okay, they're doing their thing. All right, cool. All right, let me look up. I'm going to look for a couple grids for some more divine aloes so we can get some more divine aloes, and then we'll test those guys out. Here we go. Divine. So, no. No special aloe saddles, just a regular aloe saddle. Crystal aloe skin. Oh, that's really cool. Primal crystal. Or the just a regular aloe saddle. Boom. Let me test this out real quick, make sure it works on these guys, and then we'll go get a better one. We definitely need a good level if we're going to take these guys out. Let's see. Allo. All right. There's such low levels. 29, 29, 74, 37, and when 74 is your top dino. Not great. All right. Saddle. All right. Cool. That saddle did work. Let's go ahead and see his attacks. These guys are pretty cool, if I remember correctly. It's been a while. All right. Got your left click. Also, he looks pretty epic. All right. Right click. C button. X button. Control. <gasps> what? Hold on. Don't these guys do some kind of crazy attack? What are you doing? What are you doing, lady? Hold on. Let's throw our, our guy down. Here. I need you to recruit her real quick. I don't know what she's doing. There. I'm going to leave you guys here. 115. Yeah, that'll be good. No, I thought this guy... Don't these guys do some special attack? Man. What a bummer. I thought they did. I mean, it's still an aloe. I'm still going to get a bunch of them. There we go. Finish him off. There we go. All right. Okay, yeah. We need a better one to really test it out. Yeah, I thought they... I thought these are the ones that did some crazy attack. But maybe I... I'm remembering correct incorrectly. All right, let's go look for a better one. All right, here we go. Oh, is it a special one? <gasps> it's a divine holographic. Check this out. Oh, this is great. Okay, let's go like that. Oh, there's bad things going on. Hold on, hold on. No one kill me, please. All right, kibble. Boom. Wow, what is going on there? Okay, Did they wreck whatever that was. Okay, let's go do. It's a level 140 and a level 160. Check this guy out. No, I got... No, no. Don't go anywhere. Come back. Oh, I don't have the Viterong on me. He's not going to drain out fast. Okay. Okay, we got to... Oh, jeez. What is that? Oh, it's a Seeker. Okay, Mutton. Mutton, while we're waiting. Come here, Seeker. Seeker, Seeker, Seeker. Oh, we got it. There you go. Got to be really close. I really wish the Bitterong was here. Do I have do I have one of my Bitterongs on me? We could break it out real quick. Please don't attack it. There you go. Popcorn scent. Get him. <laughs> there you go. Get those guys with that popcorn scent. Let them drain out a little. And then three over here with this guy. Drain him out too. Get hungry, dude. Okay. You guys ready? Nope. I can't see the other guy. Hopefully he's ready soon. Uh, oh, one of them's ready. Okay. Where did my bid run go? Uh, bid run? Where'd you go? There he is. I couldn't find you, man. All right. Let's pick, pick you up. All right. Let's go see these guys again. Ready to eat. This should be it. Let's go kibble. Put the kibble back down there. This would be a much better level. Yeah, uh, there you go. All right, there's one. I know, dude. All right, where's the other one? Got to get this one. This is the cool looking one. Oh, no, it's a Cardo. Crap. Oh, he went down quick. Nice. That was super lucky. All right. Yeah, there you go. All right. 
is such a good level. It came out to a 239. Oh, hold on. I need to see what your stats are. Hold on. Let me see. 32 melee and 34 health. Awesome. Okay. Pick all that up. All right. Let's go look for the Seeker real quick. All right. Seeker. No, I'm sorry. Not Seeker. Uh, What are we doing? Oh, no. Tracking. That's what we're doing. Dino tracking. Oh, the mermaid's done. Nice. Okay. Seeker. Boom. Where did it go? You think it's hungry? Should we get the bitter rung out? That's probably what we should do. Okay. Let's see if we can go down without dying. All right. Also, does the seeker attack? We, we should probably, just in case, I'm going to pick you up. We're going to switch to the bitter rung and see. If he attacks us, then we'll know. All right. Come on, daddy bitty. Here we go. 15. Are you ready to eat yet? I'm ready to eat. Okay. Let's get the mutton back over there. All right, mutton. If we had the special aura seeker stuff, this would go really fast. Uh, it's really hard to get in there. Come on. Come back. Yeah, man, this is they are hard to feed. They just have like a really weird hitbox. There you go, got it. Get him again. Get him again. It says ready to eat. Feed him. There you go. Got it. Got it. Got it. Got it. Yes. Whew, that was crazy. <laughs> yeah, we got a seeker. Nice, dude. I haven't tamed these very, very many mods. Look at this guy. Yeah, you're ugly. You are super ugly. All right, let me go back and try out the new aloe. That's kind of the big thing now. Let's take the taming tracker off so that doesn't drive us crazy. Untrack all. And then... The mermaid over here should be ready to go. Let's turn the mermaid into a mermaid shop. So we have the mermaid shop, because that's the one thing we don't have. Oh, oh, jeez. What was that? Okay. Okay. This guy might be pretty cool. Alright, let's go check on the mermaid. Should be right here. Alright. There's the mermaid. What's up? Oh, that's so cool, man. I'm so excited about this Seeker. I want to get a good one now. Look at that. You are really, really creepy looking. All right. Good job, Tamer. You're amazing. And you, you could ride it? Uh, Well, I'm kind of fat, so I can't. But normally we could. Hold on. Uh, Yep, I know we're, we're hungry. Hold on, hold on. I got it. Eat a whole bunch of that real quick. All right, mermaid. Here we go. Are you fast underwater? Do you do anything special? Oh, you're super fast. Yeah, you got a tail swipe. Right click. Oh, you got a super spin. Uh, you got a, an evil laugh. Control, control. Control did something. Oh, control did like a little back thing. Nice. Very cool, man. All right. Let's go over here. All right, now, if we do this... Look for injured heels. Set up shop. This should make her disappear and give us a mermaid shop. Yeah, there you go. Now, the mermaid shop, do you have to place it in the water or can I place it anywhere? Does it have to be on the... I think it has to be, like, on the shore. So, we'll put this, like, right outside the base. All right. Oh, yeah, definitely. Okay, cool. How far into the water does it have to be? Just a little bit? Yeah, just move it down, move it down. Boom. Oh, that's cool, man. What's up, Little Mermaid? All right, let's check out the mermaid shop. Armor. Oh, look at this. <gasps> I want this armor. It looks amazing. 35 armor. It just looks so cool. I don't know that I have angler gel. I don't have angler gel. Okay, ocean resources. Oh, you tell me there's black pearl. What? We just need cooked lamb chops. Oh, my God. It's about to be on. Cultivated angler gel. Same thing. That's insane. So I can really just pull this stuff? Why is there no cooked lamb chops for that? But there was... Okay, don't worry about it. Cultivated ammonite bile. Cultivated biotoxin. What? And it made 30? That's kind of awesome. Now, does that, does that count for that armor? It does. That's huge. Okay, go back. And then weapons. Pyrean. Some really cool... A trident. Some other ones like that. Let me see, though. Ocean resource. Can I make another... We need more of the lamb chop. Do I really not have lamb chop? Lamb. 
Okay, we're gonna have to go look and see if we can make some more. And then I'll get us the really cool armor. All right, that'll be the next episode thing. Let's throw the aloe down and just test it out real quick. Just so we can say we did. And then we will call it good today. I hope you guys enjoyed the episode. Like, comment, subscribe. Huge shout out to the patrons for making these servers possible. Huge shout out to you for checking this video. I've made it to the end of the video. My MVP, as always, uh, where's the really good aloe? 239 hollow. Looking amazing. And give me that. Thank you. Uh, are you male, female? Hold on. Male, male. Let me get the female out too. Just to see if that helps out a little. Okay, now saddle. Boom. Okay, you come here. And you come here. Come on. Let's go chomp something. Are they coming? Okay. So now, do we have any right click? There we go. There it is. Yeah! So maybe we have to have that, that pack buff in order to get the power. Is that why? <gasps> what is that? Or are you just purple because I'm on the dino? Oh, you just looked amazing. Okay. All right. C button. X button. Control. Right click. The right click does the craziness. Yeah. This is awesome. Very cool, man. Very, very cool. All right, guys. I'm going to there. That was awesome. That was, a, that was a really fun episode. Hope you guys enjoyed it. I will see you in the next one. Should have another arc video up tomorrow. And then we got Mod Spotlight Saturday, Sunday. All right. We're going to see these guys. Then I'll see you guys in the next one.